Hey, what's up everybody? So today, what we're gonna do is we're gonna talk about the ankle real quick. So uh, how we kind of just assess uh, if we have enough, enough of it. Um, I don't think that we can have enough of it. Uh, I haven't seen anybody have uh, excess to uh, so much range of motion that I think it would be a bad thing. So all we do is half kneel, heel right underneath the knee, hands on the uh, thigh. Uh, if we have a stick, use it. If not, not a big deal. Uh, without collapsing the arch, we want to try to get or try to have at least three inches from our toe to the uh, to our knee. So the space from our knee to our uh, or our toe to our knee should be three inches. If we don't have it, we're lacking a little bit of range of motion. So uh, if, if we don't have that range of motion, uh, chances are we could have a little bit of knee pain uh, or uh, problems that go uh, above stream. So. Uh, or, or, you know, if, if you've sprained an ankle or rolled your ankle, or um, chances are that, that you have a little bit of, stiff, of a stiff ankle and can cause, uh, you know, knee pain. So, Josh Rudy, I'm talking to you. You have rolled your ankles many of times and you have knee pain. I guarantee that you have not a lot of ankle range of motion. But anyway, so we can do it against the wall. So all we want to do is, if this was a wall or a chair, you can use whatever. But here... Bring the knee to the outside part of the foot without collapsing the arch and keeping the heel on the ground. Here, knee down. From there, okay? So we want to go about 10 reps. We can go against the wall or we can also just go how we tested it and come out from here, okay? So. That's all, uh, uh, obviously there, there's other things that we can do to check, but that's a very simple, easy way uh, for you to check ankle mobility. Um, so there you go, talk to you later.